Good afternoon, Builder News. Builders helping builders. We've got a new thing from a builder, ChatGPT Canvas. Let's take a look at it. Let's build something with Canvas. Introducing Canvas, a new way of working with ChatGPT to write in code, okay? Canvas, so is this a desktop app? What is this? Looks like it's a desktop app. We're introducing Canvas, a new interface for working with ChatGPT on writing and coding projects. Okay. Oh, love it. This is great. This is probably going to work well with. Um, how do I try it? I love their credits. Research lead, Karina. Ah, oh, but why aren't these links? People, they don't want to get their people poached. <laughs> uh, how do I use it? Do I just have to use ChatGPT? Oh, is this this it right here? Temporary chat, more models. GPT 4.0 with the canvas. Here we go. Um. All right. What do I want to build with canvas? Um. What do I need to build? Let's, um, let's build, I mean, let's, let's have Canvas help me build Wi-Finder, Wi-Find. So Wi-Find, this is a product of Matt um, and myself, Matt from Cowork Coffee. Check this out. Oh my goodness. You, you don't, you thought you knew coffee shops, but you didn't history of scientific innovation very tightly coupled with co coffee shops uh, do you know Isaac Newton once dissected a dolphin inside a coffee shop in front of an audience of other scientists apparently co-working was the past we think it's the future we think we think uh, working remote from coffee shops is the future apparently it was the past <laughs> history repeats history rhymes all right, anyway, why find, here we go. What I want to do is I want to add a map to this. So let's see if Mr. ChatGPT 4.0 with Can, Canmore, Canmore? Can, um, can, with Canvas can help me add. Do, 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 a map to why find. All right. Well, I think I could just do this. Oh my goodness, finally. Love it, thank you, Apple. Get the new Apple Sequoia, some bugs, but that one, that feature alone is gonna be awesome. Alrighty, so now what do I wanna do here? How do I get started? Help me add a beautiful um, open street map. Map to Wi Fi. Send. Is that it? Okay, leaflet. I think we've already got that. Okay, we want to. I think so. I think we already have a leaflet in here. We've got a keyword called map. Map. Okay. So now I just need to, how do I plot multiple points with map? Um, all right, maybe that's not the best example. Wait, hold on. What's the difference which I don't understand? Where's Canvas? Where the hell's Canvas? Okay, maybe I did it wrong. Maybe I need to do something different okay so let's do something simpler make me a portfolio website for my projects ah okay here we go god this is a lot of fucking disgusting syntax sorry Sam but it is 
why you all haven't picked up the phone and my goodness we could fucking make your shit so much better what do I call it uh, here we go god you need this gonna cheat ten thousand dollars you've got you're worth like what 100 billion <laughs> so this would cause a multiple digit percentage increase in the usability and greatness of your products for ten thousand dollars talk about the greatest deal ever anyway but that's a price right now I think I'm gonna add a couple zeros as Paul Bukite just tweeted can never have enough zeros I'm gonna throw some more zeros on that that price tag alright so what I want to see so I don't have a preview Claude gives me a preview but let's so that's so but anyway but luckily because we have the incredible the incredible scroll hub portfolio 2 whatever we can go ahead and, and write in chat GPT I can paste all this in here and then I can just do this chat gpt.html it's not going to work because I need to actually make sure this one builds first oh actually no I, it's not going to work because I named it dot scroll chat gpt.html just rename it alright now we go back here alright so think look at that scroll and chat gpt working together Wait, what? My mind just exploded. This is shit that I've built. I forgot about racetonight.com. Do I actually own that domain? Oh my goodness. I fucking forgot about this. <laughs> yes. Oh my, wait. Oh, it does, it's almost. Wow, okay, so wait. Put my real info in the site. My name is Breck Units. My email is Breck7 at gmail.com. My LinkedIn is Breck7. My GitHub is Breck7. Why 7? I don't know. Gmail required to see. Look at that. That's cool. UX. I like it. But now I got to copy it into um, into it's so funny it's like ChatGPT knows more about me than I know about myself I gotta copy it into there welcome to my portfolio connect with me on LinkedIn correct oh my goodness this is incredible oh my goodness um but wait. This is great. Well done. But add an iframe to the left of each portfolio item that the source is the project URL. Let's see. Let's see what we got. Hey, pretty good. Um, I want you to zoom out and great, but the URL for 
default y find is y find is and also I want you to use the CSS transforms for zoom to have the iframe be a zoomed out look so we can see the full page. All right. Now, of course, I kind of get the credit for this because, like, no person is going to be... Well, I mean, they could no, know to ask for that. And, and maybe I maybe I didn't even have to describe it like that. They probably could have exp explained it in, in normal words. Ugh. No, see, see, that's the thing. that I knew that ChatGPT was going to get wrong. Um... First of all, did I get the, why, why is this, why is this the weird? So, now you're shrinking, don't shrink the iframe, shrink the contents or something. The iframe should be the normal size, only the contents should be zoomed out. Now I figured this out how to do this before and I have this in chips and scroll but it took me a while to figure out. Let's see if ChatGPT can figure it out on try two. <sighs> Better but not great. And why the hell is this one broken? Page was loaded over a request of insert for a resource. Oh. So we just gotta load this. That's silly. Okay. Hey! Awesome. This was fun to make. Sam, you. you Dirty dog you, this is getting two thumbs up. Holy shit, awesome, awesome. My goodness, and what is this? I don't even think I saw this toolbar. Previous version, copy. I mean, honestly, Claude, man. Claude was my primary code editor, I'm not gonna lie, but ChatGPT just came roaring back. Cool stuff. Bravo. Cheers.